Hello, I'm Philip Entz from Buckmaster Office Solutions. Today I wanted to show a video on installing the print driver for a networked connected Ricoh device. The process is pretty straightforward. It doesn't take too much time. And the first thing that we'd want to do is open your web browser. We'd open up whether it's Firefox, Microsoft Edge, Chrome, whatever your web browser is, that's what we'd want to open. So in this case, I'm using Firefox. What we do is type in rico-usa.com in your web browser, select enter. From here, we're going to click on support and downloads. Click on support and downloads again. Scroll to the bottom to where it says more downloads and then select universal print driver. From here, we're going to look for the PCL6 V4 driver for universal print. Select on the download button. Here it will pop up a download. Depending on the web browser, it may come up on the top like it did on mine. It could be on the bottom left. What we'll want to do is click on that file that it downloaded to open it. This will open up the WinZip self extractor or if you have a different zip extractor installed, that is the default one for Windows. Select unzip. Once the file is unzipped, it will say unzip successfully. Click OK. We will want to right click on the zipped folder location here and click copy. From here, we can open up our file explorer, which is the little file icon on the bottom. Here we can actually select in the address bar and right click, click paste and select enter. This will bring us right to where our unzipped file location is. We'd want to double click on this rvsetup.exe file to run the file. This will open up the end user license agreements, which you'd want to read and agree and go to next. We'd select the network for the network printer and select next again. This is going to search your network for any available devices on the network, which should locate any devices, RICO devices that have been installed on the network successfully and is compatible with most devices within the last 10 to 15 years, so shouldn't have any trouble finding any recent devices. In this case, we're going to use the MPC4504 and select Next, but you'd want to select whichever applicable machine you have specifically on your network. And select Next. This is going to start installing the driver, which could take a few moments to complete. Once that is done, we'd want to um, select next again. You can install the device software manager if you wanted additional features, but in this case, we're just doing the print driver. So let's leave that unchecked and select next. Here you can see successfully installed device, PCL6 V4 driver for universal print. I'm showing an underscore one since I've installed this before as a test, but if we wanted to print a test page,